why would you use machine learning? Well, let's take a look at a little example. Here I have a completely made up treatment schedule for a patient. Uh, from day one through day 60, this is the correct dosage in milligrams. And now the exercise is to see whether you are actually alive and able to make noise. So, it is day two. How many milligrams do we give the patient? 17, day four. 41, day two again. 17. Would you use machine learning to solve this problem? Well, how would you solve this problem? I hope you would do a lookup. Just look the answer right up. Don't do any kind of magical learning. There's the answer, why not just look it up? So you don't need machine learning in this situation. Okay, different question for you. It is day 61. What is the answer now? Aha. Well, if there are no patterns here in these data, then you can't actually solve that. Nothing can help you for day 61. Or if there are patterns, but they just simply don't apply past day 60, they don't generalize beyond that, because maybe the patient is now healthy or, I don't know, dead, uh, then, <laughs> right, it Does, doesn't work either. So the only way that you might be able to make an attempt at day 61 is if there are patterns here that you can find and make a recipe out of and that are still relevant and useful in this new data situation. In that case, you would want to use machine learning. So I'm going to say over and over today that in machine learning, we have one job. Succeed on new stuff. That is the entire focus. Do well in new data situations, because how do you deal with the old ones? Just look it up. 